is so impressive. Wow. Don't you feel like, you feel like you're like an, I don't know, it needs to be like in an IMAX theater or something. That'd be great. Yeah. <laughs> this is Vorticity 2. It's a brand new film by one of Arizona's premier storm photographers. I'd say the premier. Is there anybody better than you, Mike? I'm There's not sure. There's some really good ones out there. All right, so Michael Binsky <laughs> spent two years shooting and saving storm time lapse video like this, and now he has released. Oh, look at that one. Oh, this is really cool. Wow. So, uh, Michael Binsky, you're here in studio good to see with you, buddy. us. Thanks good for having you. me. I yeah, appreciate nice it, to guys. see you. Always good to have you in. So, <clears throat> now this is your third movie? Well, I've done a bunch. Okay. I have a bunch of monsoon ones and a bunch of ones out in the plains, but this this one kind of the most work I've put into it. Two full years of chasing, like 55 plus days chasing, uh, I don't know, 48,000 miles driven and oh tons of footage and stuff. And so it kind of collected the best stuff I possibly could get the last two years to make the best film I could make. But we that is point. wild. So give us an idea of how do you go through some of your footage and pick the best of the best? I'm <sighs> guessing you have way more footage than I have a lot of footage using. that didn't make it. And yeah. I, sometimes I look at it and I'm like, why did that not make it? But my standards have gotten really high. And I, when I'm out there chasing, I look at this and go, this isn't going to make it. So there's no reason to even shoot it. And so my, my standards and, and what I want has like just gotten more and more um, like higher and higher. And so. Yeah. Um, Going through and picking what I want is a process. It takes a lot of time. So tell us about the film. How long is it? And um, it's about seven minutes. It's a kind of a compilation. It's got music by this guy named Luca Tensio, which is really really awesome. And I kind of try to build it to you know the slow moving stuff, and then the music picks up the pace. And at the end, the last like minute is just a crescendo of epic supercells and tornado spinning and. Hopefully, um, I don't know, kind of hits you emotionally a little bit. Hmm. Well, what, what's your favorite? You, you went out and looked at specifically kind of tornado type storms for yep. this one, right? Yep. Are, that, are those your favorite to shoot? I mean, it depends. I mean, last year here, the monsoon was so good. I mean, I chased two great dust storm days and some of the, some of the skies I saw here were incredible. Yeah. And out there, it's just a whole different thing. And I, I mean, I love it out there. It's, it's funny because if I see some of our showers that are here, and if I saw that in the plains, I probably wouldn't shoot it. Mm -hmm. but, um, but it's interesting. Out here, we have the mountains and the cactus, and it's, it's just Ooh. two totally different things. I love both of them. So give us an idea. We were just looking at some of the haboobs that moved yeah. through. You're standing there with your camera, yeah. camera gear and the huge dust storm, the wall of dust comes through. Yeah. What are you wearing? Do you have protective stuff over your mouth? No, or? I have nothing. I wear shorts <laughs> and t-shirts and nothing. I know I've seen people out there with masks. So oh, you're, yeah. you're digging I, I, dust out of your ear for oh, days. Oh man, some days, yeah. Some days you have like the, the sand in your hair. It's just suddenly how it gets lodged uh -huh. at your scalp and the car is full of dirt. And, That's like dry um, shampoo. Yeah. You know that. <laughs> <laughs> dry shampoo does not work. Yeah. Not I don't do really anything. Cleaning. I just don't care. I lived here my whole life. I just, you know, I've been in a lot of dust. So. You deal with it. You're good. <laughs> the thing about the, the time lapses, when you watch these storms come through in real time, you don't see these things. It almost like it, it opens up a whole nother window on what mm -hmm. these storms are doing. Right. And it's funny because I'll do time lapses where I take a shot every second and you'll think, what could possibly happen in a second, but you, from frame to frame, you'll see the clouds moving and you're like, there's movement happening every second. And sometimes you stare you and you don't see even it. see it happening. Yeah. And that's what got me into time lapse in the first place was wall of dust is coming and I've seen so many and I'm like, it doesn't look like it's moving, but I know it's getting closer. And then yeah. you see it sped up and you see everything happening oh, wow. and it's, it's incredible. So real quick, you teach classes. Yeah, um, I do workshops. I actually have one starting on a, like Thursday afternoon down in Tucson. I do a couple of those every summer. And then we, um, on the, for this stuff, the tornadoes, we take, uh, we do tours out on the plane. So oh, really? this year we did three of them. We had five people in each and we took a van, which is a little bit yeah. tough in a van, but it was fun. Yeah. All these people come from all over the world, you know, Australia, Kuwait and all this stuff to do see different. Do they really? Yeah, wow. it's a huge, it's a huge thing. I'm so not the first person to do this by a long <laughs> shot. People have been doing tours forever, but people, right. We have the best storms in the Central Plains, the yeah. best tornadoes, best supercells, and people come from so everywhere. So you're not like in a tank, you're in a van. I'm not. There's people that have some of those armored vehicles. <laughs> yeah. But no, we're, you know, we're photographers. People that come with me are usually photographers, and they yeah. want to get beautiful photos. So we're a little further back. We're not oh. usually in the, in the hail and right with, by the tornado. With we a try really to good get, lens. Yeah, yeah, we try to get back where yeah. we're not getting rained on and hailed on, yeah. even though that's you know, happened to me a Plus few times. Plus you have kids, year. and so you have to protect your life. I got to protect you know what I, mean? I do. They're here I in really studio, do. They're here sitting over there on their iPad. <laughs> and like they are my motivation to you know get back. I don't want to do anything stupid. I don't. I really you know don't want to be dangerous. And people can see your movie right now, right? Where yeah, they can look. Just look my name up on YouTube and Vimeo and Facebook and Twitter and all that stuff. And yeah. it's there, so. Michael, it's great talking yeah. with you, buddy. Good luck nice with the new movie. Nice to see you again. I appreciate it. Thank you yeah. guys so much.